average bike assembly on a week, right? Yeah. One of the things I wanted to discuss was also the option of whether we would ever look at having a road trailer for the actual craft itself. If it was part of our setup that the craft sort of lived in, it would keep it safe and it would also allow us some flexibility if we did want to shift location relatively quickly, which, which may you know, be a, a benefit yeah, yeah. for the program. Can we just a thought? Can we get a price here to me? Do you want to look at it? <laughs> it kind of confirms how big this thing's going to be when you see something like this in the flesh. Every time we go on the salt, we've got to leave a really like light footprint. We can't take big machinery on there, so we'll kit set the, the land yard into pieces on here. Should be able to roll it off with no ramps required. I left with a chance of, of helping with the challenge you've got. We sort of pride ourselves on innovation and, and technology and we got to experiment a little bit with, with a trailer of this size. We've never built one this long. Just knowing that it's going to be with a sort of an experimental craft and you know we just wanted to be part of it. They're just a great Kiwi company that's forward thinking that wanted to get behind us and in terms of the technology of what they've got to offer here with this lowering yep. mechanism. Yeah there's no place we could really go that could deliver a product like this to be quite honest. Yeah. at uh, Southern Spa, we've got to pick up the wing, maiden voyage for the trailer, first off to the um, build facility over at uh, Omega, so I'm going to strap it on with these uh, new fancy little tie-down clips. Thanks mate, bloody awesome. Yeah, we'll see you then soon.